Here's that column. We're getting ready to put sheetrock mud on there. But what I like to do is I like to put some tape right there close to the outside corner uh, from the ground up to about four feet or so. That way if anybody bumps into that with a cart, a chair, a box, uh, whatever, um, it's not going to have a tendency to crack out the, uh, the outside corner. So um, I'm going to put some webbing tape down on one of these corners prior to installing the sheetrock mud. It's a good habit to get into. Uh, I can't tell you how many times I've seen people's outside corners with a hairline crack there. You see that hairline crack because um, there's no tape there between the outside edge of the corner bead and the sheetrock. So uh, get into that habit. You don't have to do the whole corner, like I say, just from the ground up to four feet or so. I'm just going to take my webbing tape and put it on there. Wipe it on. Give it a good overlap. That's as far as I'm going to go. That's plenty high. Rip it off. Okay, now I'm going to do that on, the, on this other side here too. I know it's kind of up tight in the corner here, but you never know if it's going to get hit. Doesn't take very long to put this on. It's better to be safe than sorry, I always say. A bit off. Okay. Well, that didn't take very long. Now that corner is all nice and ready. Get in the habit of doing your corners that way.